hi welcome i miss you very much i mean it's been a very long time my face got reviewed on this channel um the very last video i did it was a voiceover on a very simple recipe for pizza that even guys can try right after watching this video you may want to go and then check that out but hey i'm here i'm here i'm here and i don't know whether i'm the only person that is thinking this christmas is going to be boring oh, what do you think <laughs> cause i don't know whether it's a worldwide problem but things are quite hard i mean way back in time approaching christmas by now you should have gotten i mean your christmas shoe if not um two just one your christmas dress the hat the spectacles for the kids and all that but I don't know how this Christmas is going to be and I don't know whether it's just a problem on my side or it's a worldwide problem. You can drop in the comment section, maybe your country is different. But you know, whether we like it or yes, Christmas is here and we will surely experience it. Whether we like it or yes, as long as we pray for long life, you will see the new year. These are certain facts that you need to know before approaching them, especially in these hard times and in these trying times. If you are not a subscriber yet, please subscribe and let's get right into the video. Do you know that unfulfilled goals in 2022 can be pursued in 2023 i mean for most of the times when the year is coming to an end and you find yourself not able to achieve your goals for the year you get so disappointed and it affects you so much you feel i mean the time bound set for your goals is up and then you find yourself setting a whole new set of goals for the next year but in actual sense, there, there is a very thin line between 2022 and 2023, especially at the 11th hour. I mean, when it gets to 31st December 2022, it's just a matter of hours, a matter of second, a matter of minutes to move you on to the next year. So why do you aspire your goals? okay it's fine when you set goals for yourself and you are able to achieve it's so nice it's so perfect but then if you set the goals and you are not able to achieve if you believe that god can make it possible for you on 31st december 2020 i mean some of us have so much faith that if we want something to be accomplished in our lives even on the 31st december 2022 things can happen if you believe that then you should be also hopeful that it can also happen on first january 2023 or any other day in january or any other day in the first half of the year so you shouldn't give up on your goals especially if that is achievable ones you should not give up on them you also know that christmas comes with a whole lot of expenses i mean just on chilling and spending on yourself but sometimes we forget as parents we forget as um, i mean responsible adults that just in some few weeks after christmas is a new year that also comes with a whole lot of bunch expenses i mean expenses on rent expenses on bills expenses on um fees okay so even as you approach christmas you should have a plan you should plan so well that right after christmas you wouldn't go broke <laughs> because if you're a parent and you need to pay your world's fees or if you're a responsible adults and you need to pay your bills and all that other stuff you get really stranded you can't just enjoy and thinking that you know it's the end of the year fine you need to celebrate you need to celebrate the birth of jesus you need to celebrate your life the fact that you are alive you need to celebrate because we, we've had a lot of lost souls within the year and so if you find yourself at the end of the year definitely you have to enjoy but 
you will not also die on 31st okay you move on onto the next year and in there there are a lot of expenses that you need to cater for so you should be wise in your spending you should create a budget for yourself in I mean, including in that the next year expenses, because next year from Christmas is just some few weeks away, and you don't want to be found stranded at all. At all, we should plan wisely and talk about heavy spending that occurs during Christmas. BB Street Carnival is coming off again on the twenty third December to twenty fourth December. In Accra, Ghana, at Peck Farm, the technology road, you don't want to miss it. I mean, it's an opportunity for you as a young entrepreneur to partake in it. As people are spending, they are spending on your product, and it's even a way to just amass wealth, okay? To move to the next year. Please don't miss it. I'll leave the number of BB on the screen. Please pick it up and link up with her and let her book a space for you and come and sell your product. I'll be there with the entire team of this crown and it's going to be fire 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 for fire and do you also know that Christmas is to mark the birth and the coming of Christ to save our lives I mean we've had a lot of Christmas coming and go and living with people Christmas come and go and live with people because people forget the the, the reason for Christmas I mean, they forget about their maker. They forget about giving reference to God. People drink alcohol, heavy alcohol. People just drive messlessly and mess up with their lives. I mean, we've had a whole lot of Christmas that takes away the life of people. Christmas is supposed to bring life to us. Okay. And even for the fact that you've been protected from day one okay till 25th december and the days afterwards you have to give reference to god so during christmas please find a, a church and attend okay find a church if you've not been to church i mean people go to church on the 31st december um, that's cool but on christmas day please try even if you're not going to church Please pray to God, okay? <laughs> yes, yeah, so that's it. Please try as much as you can to um, restrain yourself from going to places that may end up taking your life. Like if you don't know how to swim and there is a pool party somewhere, you don't want to risk it, okay? If you don't know how to drink alcohol and friends are dragging you to places that, I mean... They are doing all sorts of things. Don't go and drink alcohol and die. But all the same, it's a time to celebrate and you got to celebrate. But then in all that, you give reverence to God. Find a church and go on Christmas Day. Okay. <laughs> yes. And then finally, I've seen a number of people postponing forgiveness to 31st December of each year. Please, if someone has wronged you and you can really forgive, kindly forgive today, okay? The rate at which people are dying is just alarming. I mean, what on earth are we here for? Come on. No matter how someone hurts you, okay? If you, you feel, you know, you can forgive and advise yourself. But you shouldn't take so much things that hurt that you don't you hold forgiveness of a person you don't know who is going next and you don't want to live with unforgiveness in your heart christ came to save us and to forgive us from all our wrongs and all our sins and i mean to partake in that you have to forgive i'm not here to preach but the scripture said Forgive us, even as you forgive those who trespass against us. And it's in the Lord's prayer. Please, if you can forgive someone today, forgive, okay? People are dying. And anytime I hear someone I know dying, I mean, I get heartbreak. And it's so heartbreaking. Just imagine the person you hate the most dying today. Will you cry or will you laugh? definitely right after the person go you would come and give tribute there is something you know there's something that a person did that 
you enjoyed the person was a blessing to you don't wait till someone die before you show that thing please 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 thank you so much for watching please like this video subscribe to this channel and we have another interesting channel i mean that channel is on fire okay we have a relationship channel we talk about matters of the heart love i mean everything to spice up our love and our relationship life so if you're not a subscriber of that channel yet kindly subscribe and be part of that wonderful family as well i'll leave the link to that channel right in the comment section please subscribe and be part of that wonderful family